Hey everybody, Scott Spritzer here, DocSports.com. Welcome to the update for Friday, October 25th, 2019. Got a free pick coming up in just a moment. First, a quick note, if you've yet to take advantage of the discounted offer for the rest of the football season, which at DocSports.com includes both college football and the NFL, you can still do so, but not for much longer. It's going to be going back to the regular price real soon. But here's the offer, 33% off the rest of the college football and NFL season. It's all coming together, all one package, 33% off. You don't have to purchase the two leagues separately. It's all one big package over at DocSports.com. Uh, all you got to do is go over to the website, click on my homepage, click on the package. You'll get 33% off the rest of the football season. And here's what will happen. A box will pop up. It'll ask you for a code word. That code word is FBSEASON33. That's FBSEASON33. It's all one word. All right, here's what's going on. Yesterday, we cashed again. We've had a nice week uh, since Monday. And we did cash again yesterday going to a and one. However, it could have been a great week if the Washington Capitals were able to hold on to a two-goal lead up three to one in the third period before allowing a game-tying goal with about a minute and oh, 30 seconds to go and then losing in overtime. That was the one loss. Uh, the two wins were the Redskins and the NFL. Nice way to start off the new football week. We cashed with the Skins now. 72 and 50, 59% with our last 122 NFL plays. Few pushes in there also, but 72 and 50 after the Redskins cashed on Thursday night. And we want to get in the NBA. We are now 3-0 this season with premium NBA picks at DocSports.com. 47-27 with our last 74 premium picks in the NBA at DocSports.com going back to last year. That's 64% against the spread. If you include the two free picks we've had in the NBA so far here on the videos, we are a perfect 5-0 so far this season in the NBA. We had the Clippers last night, and they rocked Golden State virtually start to finish in that game last night. Clippers looking outstanding. Imagine what they're going to be like with Paul George gets back on the floor. We've already used him twice this season. We had him against the Lakers, and then we had him, of course, last night uh, against Golden State. Golden State opens up the new arena, got smacked right across the chops. All right, so that's what's going on. Uh, here's what else is going on for Friday. We've got NBA. I've got one play. Uh, we look to go to 4 0 with our premium NBA picks, 6 0 overall with our NBA. One pick, one play, one side in Friday's NBA. It'll be available at 1 p.m. Eastern, 10 a.m. Pacific over at DocSports.com. I've also got NHL for Friday. Listen, again, we came up short last night, but we went into last night on a 5-0 run with our previous five picks in the NHL, and we're still hitting almost 70% against, or not against the spread, but 70% in the NHL uh, with our bets so far this season, premium picks over at uh, DocSports.com. And going back to last year, I told you I like those early seasons in the NHL, the early season numbers. We are now 36-18, and 18, October, November run, going back to the start of last year's October in the NHL. So a lot going on on Friday, and of course, with the Redskins cashing on Thursday night in the NFL. Uh, that means we have eight plays to go in college and pro football for this upcoming weekend. Not playing the Friday night college football game, but I will be in action uh, with Saturday and Sunday's card. We've got college football, of course, and the NFL, and we'll close it out with Monday night football. Basically, a Thursday through Monday package is what we had over at DocSports.com, and you can still get Saturday, Sunday, and Monday. Seven units play going in Saturday's college football and six unit play leads the way in Sunday's NFL. So don't miss out. 59% our last 120 plus NFL plays. In fact, our last 415 NFL plays going back several seasons, upwards of 57% winners. That includes a top 20 money finish in the Westgate Super Contest a couple of years ago. So listen, it's been going on for a while for us. Every once in a while, you have a losing day, but we usually bounce back and out of a heck of a nice long-term run with college football and the NFL. Enough of that stuff. Again, Friday NBA, Friday NHL. Uh, still have eight plays left in college and pro football Saturday through Monday. Go grab it all over at DocSports.com. Let's get to the free pick. And uh, it is World Series Game 3 on Friday as the teams head to D.C. And listen, so far what we've seen, I talked about this on the Mad Dog Radio Show on Wednesday night. We see Houston hitting line drives everywhere, but they're hitting them right at Washington outfielders. It's basically what it's been about when it comes to their at-bats. Now, Washington has been getting a lot of nice runs. They've been placing the ball where it needs to be, hitting it out when they need to. And uh, they got the big win the other night in game two, 12 to three. 
But check out what ESPN did, put together this nice stat, kind of backing up what I was saying on Mad Dog Radio the other night. If you look at Houston and the reason they still have a shot, uh, their batting totals are decent so far for the first two games of the World Series. Pretty close to what the Nationals are doing for the most part. Uh, the average exit velocity, according to ESPN, through the first two games, Nationals 88.1 miles per hour, Astros 88.6 miles per hour. Astros actually, with the average exit velocity being even faster than what Washington's been doing and the number of hard outs also posted over at ESPN these are balls that are hit over 95 miles per hour with a launch angle between 3 and 45 degrees so far those number of hard outs two for the Nationals eight for the Astros that tells you exactly what I was saying on Mad Dog Radio the other night the Astros are hitting the heck out of the ball they're just hitting it right to fielders right now for the Washington Nationals and it could stay that way for the rest of the series you know how that goes but the bottom line is a virtually a must-win situation we do believe that Houston will come through on Friday night listen they win one of these two games well actually if they win game three is what it comes down to uh, then it's a situation where they can still win this series because you get back to what game five I guess it'll be you get Cole back, you get Verlander back, and they got a chance to redeem themselves. So as far as I'm concerned, uh, the free pick tonight is on the Houston Astros. Got to lay around a buck 40 or thereabouts in this particular matchup over Honorable Sanchez. Again, we're going to go with Houston Game 3 World Series action on Friday night for our free video pick. All right, listen, that's going to do it for us. Don't forget about the rest of the football weekend. Off to a 1-0 start with the Redskins on Thursday. Eight plays to go. Seven unit in college football. Six unit highlights the NFL. Also, NBA, we look to stay perfect on the season and go to 4-0 and with our premium picks at the play on Friday afternoon. And we've also got uh, NHL going on Friday. So it's all available on Friday over at DocSports.com. The NFL, the college football package, available right now, obviously, as we speak. I'm Scott Sprites at DocSports.com. Check, uh, click on that, uh, if you like the videos, by the way, click on that thumbs up button. And uh, if you would like to subscribe, go ahead, man. We do appreciate those who have done so thus far. Scott Sprites at DocSports.com. Let's put Friday in the win column. I will be back here early as usual for Fridays, probably around 10 p.m. Pacific at the latest with Saturday's report. We'll talk to you then.